And if I do that, I find these are the seven core areas of a syllabus. Live ethics. And you find uh, geography has an overlap with these four areas. Geography directly with paper one. You have got uh, overlap in IR. You cannot do IR without geographical knowledge about where what lies. The entire geopolitics. Okay. All you cannot talk about earthquakes or cyclones. You cannot talk about heat waves or tsunamis for that matter. Landslides or forest fires. Okay. That's geography. And of course, we have a huge amount of geography in the development economy part. Construction, roads, exports, imports, and so on. And that's the reason why uh, students tell us the whole person, perhaps in more in some ways. Okay, that was uh, pitching uh, the importance of geography. Uh, by the way, uh, I know some of you have chosen otherwise. That's perfectly fine. I can only speak as a geography teacher. Okay, so take it with that sense. Okay, I'm not to say that other subjects don't matter. They do matter. And that's your comfort level. But those who are on the fence, you can't decide on which optional. Okay, those who are unsure about, should you go for geography or not, I'm pitching it for them. So, and that's the reason why uh, most of environment teachers are teachers. I also, uh, in the GS, back in my institute, I am the uh, teacher for environment. I also teach IR and I also te teach topics of development economics. Like, we have a test series running. I handle that. You have some questions I need to answer online? Okay, fine. Take it.